if you don't follow the Hadith, then how do you know how to pray? Peace and love. As-salamu alaykum. May God's peace be upon everyone watching this video. So, it's been a while since I posted a video, a current video. I post videos, but they're older videos. So this is a new video. So what's the date? Uh, May 5th, 2024. Note it. Take note. No. Um, don't take note. But I do want to talk about something that I believe needs to be talked about. And it needs to be something that gets out into the social media world. So Muslims will start believing the truth, which is the Muslim prayer is not from Hadith. That's just a fact. That's a 100% without a doubt fact. The Muslim prayer is not from Hadith. And I say that because I'm seeing a lot of Muslims say, if you don't follow the Hadith, then how do you know how to pray? And this is just mind-boggling because Muslims don't learn how to pray from the Hadith. So I don't even know why they say it, except the fact that the Hadith has become so instilled in the Islamic community that people think the religion is from the Hadith. But how to pray is not from the Hadith. This is just a fact. The Muslim prayer existed before Hadith. The Muslim prayer was taught by Prophet Muhammad to his community. And his community taught others in their community. And it was passed down from the time of Prophet Muhammad to the next generation. And then that generation passed it down to the next generation. And it's been passed down all the way down to how we pray the Muslim prayer today. So the community is what preserved how to pray the Muslim prayer. This is just Islam 101. And many Muslims don't know this. And it's troubling because they're saying things that they think they know, such as the Muslim prayer is from Hadith, and then when you say it's not, then they get all angry and curse you out. I've had it done. And say that you're a disbeliever or think that I'm a Quranist because I say that and I'm not a Quranist. I just know the place of Hadith within Islamic history. And I know that the way to pray was preserved by the community, not by Hadith. Now, I'm not saying Hadith cannot point to something Prophet Muhammad said in regards to the Muslim prayer, but it wasn't preserved by Hadith. And Muslims don't learn how to pray the Muslim prayer by going to the Hadith. A Muslim learns the Muslim prayer from someone within the community. It has always been like that from the time of Prophet Muhammad to now. And Muslims need to understand this. And this needs to get out there. This doesn't mean you're a Quranist just because you think the Muslim prayer is not from Hadith. Or better put, you know the Muslim prayer is not from Hadith. The Muslim prayer was preserved by the community. And you don't want to dismiss the power of community. It's very powerful. So this way of prayer is a communal ritual practice. And that's very powerful. That preserves ritual practices. And the ritual itself preserves the ritual practice. This is just the power of community. So know that. Hopefully the word can get out more and more. And Muslims will let go of this false concept that the Muslim prayer is from Hadith. Because the Muslim prayer is not from Hadith. Period. Peace and love.